how to remove the head unit assembly. If you need to clean, repair or replace any of the components in the head unit assembly, you will need to remove it from the conveyor. You will need two people to do this job. First, remove the external scrapers and belt. Go to our YouTube channel to watch a video on how to do this. Remove the curved end beds by undoing all the torque head fixings. Then, lift the conveyor onto its side so you can access the underside. Remove the torque head fixings from the underside of the curved end bed. Then lift it off. Remove the plug and play cable from the motor mount. Lift the conveyor back down to horizontal. Carefully pull out the head unit assembly. This is a heavy assembly, so we recommend two people do this. One person takes the weight on the back of the motor, while another person slides the assembly out. To put the head unit assembly back, first spray the internal openings with Kavea Multipurpose Lubricant Spray. Lift the head unit assembly and slide it carefully into the frame. Replace the curved end bed, making sure you replace all the torque head fixings on both the top and the underside of the bed. Lift the conveyor onto its side. While doing up the torque head fixings on the underside, one person needs to push on the head assembly to ensure it is fully fitted. Lastly, insert the plug and play cable into the motor mount. Replace the belt and external scrapers. Track and tension the belt. It is now ready to use.